All right, so let's jump into text widget. And this is the first ever widget which we're gonna be uh, understanding and applying. So let's just go into chatbot builder and simultaneously on another browser, I'll actually go into my actual account and click on enter chatbot builder. So now in this dummy account, uh, let's first and foremost uh, create this group. So obviously we have already created this group early on. So we had a group and then we have a page and inside that page, we also uh, saw that how I personally name this, you can name it according to your wish, according to your psychology, uh, according to your understanding. But now once we have this page, uh, let's click on this text widget and let's see how it actually looks and uh, works. So in this text widget, what happens is when you type anything, so let's say this is where you put your uh, text information, right? Text information. Uh, you can also insert some smileys over here. So if I click on this, uh, you can have frequently used or you can use this. You can also search. This is something which I really liked. Uh, I've used many chat as well, but uh, in many chat, this feature is yet not there as of now I'm recording this. Uh, so this is January 2019. I don't know when they update their feature in many, many chat, but currently they don't have this feature. You have to actually scroll like this and then search. And now mobile monkey is also having this text form. All right. As soon as we move our cursor, it actually says what it is all about. And then there is a code as well. So if I, so let's suppose if I move over here and there is a code right to the bottom where it says in gray color, colon hard underscore eyes colon so if i probably write this is a new update even i don't know uh colon heart underscore eyes colon and now probably uh, this particular piece of code might be the smiley over there all right so we'll try this and uh, we'll put up a smiley as well so let's see if we get two smileys or not in the actual message if it happens it's good or else that's just for uh, information so we are just testing around uh, so once this is a text uh, in the text widget, uh, you can always or obviously you can hit enter and write more so you can write more text over here and blah, 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 whatever it is. All right. You can delete the widget from this. You can hide the widget like this so that it's in order. Uh, and this particular thing which will be helpful when we have attributes. All right. So I'll talk about these attributes. Uh, these are the custom made attributes uh, later on once we have full information. So right for the timing, I'll just skip this part of attribute. But now there is this thing called add button. So if I click on add button, uh, I can write anything like, let's say um, button text. I'll just have button text. And what do you want? When somebody is clicking on this button, do you want them to redirect to another page or you want them to actually give you a call? So let's suppose if you write a number, I'll just randomly write anything and uh, based upon the number it will just pick up the country or you can manually search for your country first so let's say India and then you can write your number all right uh, on top of that uh, you can uh, just redirect them to your URL so let's suppose if I want to redirect all my visitors to my let's say Instagram profile right so let's say HTTPS www.instagram.com slash digital Pratik and if I click on add button, that will add up. So let's try all three of them. Uh, so I'll just, first of all, this is my Instagram profile. So uh, my Instagram, so my Instagram, or you can be creative. So I will say one or free uh, one minute videos, all right? And uh, maximum you can have only these many characters, all right? So you cannot type more. So just make sure you use them effectively so i'll insert one smiley as well so let's search for camera because it is video so try to have a button which is super 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 engaging so try to incorporate text try to incorporate smileys uh, if you have some characters left so once it is done click on add button and your button will be added now how many buttons you can have in one text widget probably you can add three that is what i know i don't know if they have updated today <laughs> since yesterday or uh, till last night it was three so let's click on add once again and this time I'll just add number so let's say call me directly and uh, let's say I'll insert a phone character let's say this one all right 
and I'll click on phone I'll search for India and I'll randomly enter a number right click on add button and there you go let's add the third one and this would redirect to a page so let's call this as mm, 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 test page I'll just write it test page now over here there are no new pages the only page which ever which we are able to see is happy new year landing page so now assume how you can effectively use this uh, if if you have something like uh, in, in this particular thing if you have uh, what do you say this is the text and you can always um, visit my you can know more you can uh, p.s know more about my story right that's the thing now I'll click on add button and I will say uh, my story and now there is no page first I will have to create a page so click on add button let it be as it is we can change it later now over here make sure make sure you have added one page now that page can be in any group so let's suppose if you add a page over here and just just for the sake of me uh, I'm writing this my story page you can write anything over here right you can write any name this is just for your uh, surfing inside your mobile monkey account right so my story page over here or maybe I can just create a, a separate folder all right so they have named folder now all right uh, this this groups are actually folders now so one and the same groups or folders so I'll say new folder and in this new folder I'll say this is for uh, my birthday all right let's say I'm creating a specific bot for my birthday and I click on this so now I have my birthday and inside my birthday if I have my story page uh, two, let's say and I would call this particular story page as one all right so I have my story page one and my story page number two so I can add any one of them so now once again in happy new year and happy new year landing page where our text widget is I would be writing or I would be clicking on my story and now I can actually select this page so let's suppose if I click on my story page one and update the button there is no more buttons to be added so just remember or uh, till now in January 2019 we are only able to add three buttons in one text widget if you want to add more you can you, you can be creative enough you can just click on text and uh, you can type like this um, uh, 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 here are a few here are a few more options for you or here are a few more options and just have this particular arrow so let's say down and hand and you can once again add more button so more button or button number four all right and let's add a URL I'll add my website click on add button and there you go you can add more buttons like that so just for the demo demonstration purpose I'm just doing this one now uh, if somebody is clicking on this and let's actually add one more button and let's try my story page 2 as well so I'll click on this uh, this is my or let's say button number 5 and this would redirect to my story page 2 click on add button and that's it all right so let's just configure a little bit over here as well my story page one because when somebody is interacting with your button and if they click on that uh, the bot won't respond anything it would redirect to this particular page but just because we don't have anything over here it won't respond anything it would be blank so your visitor would think that it's a blank maybe your bot is hung up right <laughs> or it's not functioning so you make sure you have something over here so my story page one I'll just once again just because we are going through text I don't want to use anything else which we'll do later on when we actually create a complete bot specific to categories all right so right now let's add one more text widget and I will say this is my story page one text widget so that when we are testing the bot we can know that yes the button was working and in the I'll just copy this text so that I don't have to write my story page two as well I'll just have text and I will have page 
two text widget and let's add one smiley as well for this so that it differentiates two of these that's that's all all right now what we can do is uh, we can test this bot now your entry point your entry point for this happy new year kind of a bot was this page so if you want to test right now what you have to do click on this and then click on test this page so that it will start your bot from this widget and then it will progress so i'll click on test this page so it will uh, ask me to open messenger i'll have to open the messenger and make sure you are logged into your facebook account which you have used to create this mobile monkey account all right though bo both of them should be same right now or else probably it might not work so digital prati company and there you go this is where you put your text information so that heart eyes is actually not working but but just to see that this is the first ever time we are actually automating our bot so if you are here for the first ever time and if you have never ever created a bot just look at this we just created the text widget which is actually automating our processes inside facebook messenger isn't that isn't that cool so like this is working this is in real time this is this is where you put the text information write more text over here ps no more about my story then there are three buttons free one minute videos call me directly my story and here are a few more options button number 4 button number 5 all right so as you can see this is completely working as per our knowledge and uh, if we tap on any of the buttons let's see that what what happens when we click on buttons so i'll say free 1 minute videos which will redirect to my instagram profile so let's see if it works or not yes indeed it is working now if we tap on call me directly it will obviously open up the face time for me but look at this the number is correctly working if you test this on mobile phone obviously it would redirect to uh, or or it will show you a pop up it will show you a pop up where it will ask you to call and if you click on my story then another page so let me just minimize this if you click on my story uh, the button is actually working and then it is saying this is my story page one text widget and when you click on button number 4 button number 4 will re redirect to my website which i told you earlier so yes this is also working correctly and now if i click on button number 5 it would give you this is my story page 2 text widget and with a smiley so let's try that button number 5 let's tap on that and bingo this is my story page 2 text widget with a smiley awesome <laughs> so this is completely working did you see that it is actually working so that's how you test your bot and that is how you can use your text widget effectively all right so in the next video we'll see how you can use image widget and guys don't worry uh, right now you must be feeling that how do you interconnect all of these widgets and how do you effectively use them it will all make sense if you go step by step trust me trust me i have your hand in hand and i'm going to walk you step by step without any steps missed all right i don't want to go fancy i don't want to show you the theoretical knowledge that why chatbot is so important and blah 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 it is important it is super 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 important right now all right and i want to give you as much practical knowledge as i can so that's the reason why it is text image form quick question gif and everything step by step will go and then finally uh, after a couple of videos we'll be actually creating specific bots let's suppose if you are a lawyer I will teach you how you can completely create a bot for lawyer. If you are a chiropractor, uh, like let's say physiotherapist, I'll show you how you can create that. If you are a influencer on Instagram, how you can create that. If you are a doctor, how to create bot for you, all right? If you are a car dealer, if you are a, a service provider, whatever, digital marketing agency, or just a digital marketer like me. So you have in your hands some gold mine practical knowledge. Make sure you learn, apply, and share. All right. I'll see you in the next one.